game day. I got my Newton jersey on. Uh, getting ready to go tailgates early. The game's at 425, as you already know. Um, I'm geared down. I probably dress a little bit warmer because it's freezing. It's like 30 degrees. Um, it's going to be a crazy day. It's New Year's Eve. There's a lot going on, of course. Um, got a hotel downtown that we're going to be staying at, but check in's not till 3 o'clock. And I got to try to work something out early because the tailgate starts at 1, and then we're marching to the stadium at 3, meeting up with a bunch of Carolina fans, and we're going to just pregame, chill. Uh, I think Cam's food truck is going to be out there. So it's going to be amazing. Um, this is the one game I always go to every every season. Well, the past few seasons, I guess. But we'll see. I mean, it's going to be a great game. Uh, I don't know what to expect, though, from the team. Um, if, if you go check out my video that I made, my preview of the game, uh, I predicted the Falcons to win because I just think they're going to be a little bit more desperate. But it doesn't matter. We're not getting into that. Um it's gonna be fun though. So uh make sure you guys stay tuned. Um it's gonna be a blast. <laughs> Alright, I'm at the Panthers tailgate. It's approximately negative twenty-eight degrees. A little bit of exaggeration, but um it's gonna be a good day. About to meet up with some Panthers faithful, get some drinks in. Got the lady with me. She's Panther down, she looks miserable because it's cold, but it's all good. About to have fun. So we just got to our seats at the game. Uh, crazy, this stadium is amazing. It's huge. Uh, the helo board is ridiculous. Um, I'll be sure to get some shots of that, but I'm ready for the game. We got about a, a little less than, less than an hour to the kickoff, so I'm ready. Um, my hands are finally defrosting. A bunch of friendly Carolina Panthers fans, they gave us some hand warmers. Uh, my hand warmer. I don't know what my hand warmer is. It's cold. It was cold outside. It was like 30 something degrees. Um, yeah, good old hand warmer. Come handy. Uh, it's still warm. But uh, I'm hungry. I want to get some food, but it's amazing. Like, we made it. Um, the tailgate was cool. I'm glad we kind of got to that. We got kind of got to the tailgate late. But I'm glad we got there late because. I wouldn't have been able to last for a whole three hours at the tailgate. So, whatever. But there's a lot of Panthers fans here. Charlotte definitely traveled well. Uh, we'll see what happens. So, uh, it's cool. This Hula Boy is amazing, though. So, I get to try. So, I just left the game. It wasn't the, end. It wasn't the game that I expected. The result was what I expected. Panthers laid down. Um, even with the Saints losing. It was crazy. Um, they had a chance to win the division, but they didn't. A lot of fun. The energy was pretty crazy, but the Falcons fans are annoying, man. They like they won the Super Bowl. They stuck in the playoffs. But it is what it is. Heading back to the hotel. It's freezing out here. Decided to walk back. Uber there, walk back. So I'll drop a recap sometime soon, probably today or tomorrow. Depending on what's going on, probably tomorrow most likely. So, stay tuned. So I just got back to the hotel. Just give my quick reaction to the game. Uh, like I said before in my preview, my prediction video, or whatever, um, I told the key to the game was getting complacent, and that's exactly what Carolina did. That was part of the biggest factor, and the reason why I picked the Falcons to win the game. Unfortunately, uh, it sucked being at the game, being a Panther fan, and hearing all that trash talk. They're annoying. Uh, that's all I got to say. But um, they just seemed complacent. Cam just seemed lackadaisical. Um, he went. He started the game 0 for 9. They said that was a, a franchise record. Worse, 0 for 9 passing. Uh, it was just rough. McCaffrey dropping one-hand passes. Olsen didn't get involved. We didn't try to run the ball. Um, Stewart was a surprise scratch. They said he had back soreness is what I saw on Twitter. Um, so that was a shock, too. Um, Cameron Artis Payne, he got he had a couple good carries, but he was dropping, he was fumbling simple handoffs, simple like toss plays. You could tell he hadn't really practiced much with the starters. So, um, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, I mean, it's, it, it, the playoff schedule just came out. I just got the the word. I think it is uh, we they Carolina plays at 4:40 on Sunday. They play the Saints, man. Part three, the trilogy. Uh, 
sirens outside. It's the new year. Um, I don't know what's going on. We'll see. They're already out here on it. At least, honestly, I'll be safe. But, uh, another one? All right, whatever. But, part three of the trilogy, the Saints at, in New Orleans again. Candace, it's hard to beat a th team three times. Um, I got to look at some film. I didn't watch the Saints game. They lost. That's the worst part about it. The Panthers had a chance to win the division because the Saints lost to the Bucks. The Bucks have been playing hard the past few weeks. They finally gave Carolina a gift that they needed. And Carolina, they peed in the bed. It's what it is, you know. Um, they saw they saw it themselves. They laid down and laid an egg. Um, I don't know. It's not a game you want to have going into the playoffs, so it sucks. But like I'd always say, it is what it is. I don't know. Um, I, I need to see some answers though. The offense just looked like nothing. They made they made Atlanta's defense look like world beaters. Um, I think they might have had just over 200 yards, and most of that came in garbage time in that last drive. It was it sucked. Um, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I'll probably get my further breakdown later on um, in the week when I get a chance to watch the tape again, and then just break it down a little bit more. But my instant reaction, I, I, it, it sucks. All right, but you guys let me know what you thought about the game. Um, a lot of people y'all pick the Panthers to win. I I hate to be right in this instance that I picked the Falcons, but it happens. Still made the playoffs. There's a lot to be okay about because a lot of players were injured, but y'all just let me know what happened in the comments, what y'all thought about what happened in the comments. Um, what do you think is going to happen in the playoffs? Let me know down below in the comments. Uh, but like that, I'm out.